both Canadian duos eliminated from Tokyo Olympic Beach Volleyball quarterfinals. Open this photo in Gallery Sarah Pavan of Canada in action with Melissa Humana Paredes of Canada. Canada is heading home from the Women's Beach Volleyball Tournament at the Tokyo Olympics empty-handed. Sarah Pavan and Melissa Humana Paredes lost in three sets to Australia's Maria Fartacho del Sola and Talaqua Clancy in Tuesday's quarterfinals immediately after teammates Heather Bansley and Brandy Wilkerson suffered the same fate against Latvia's Tina Grodina and Anastasia Kravsnoka. Pavan and Humana Paredes, the sport's reigning world champions, hadn't trailed at all in the event, but dropped the opening set 21-15 against the Australians. Canada had two shots at getting into the semi-finals and would have been guaranteed a spot in the gold medal game if both squads advanced. Instead, the program will remain with a solitary bronze won by the men when beach volleyball was first introduced as an Olympic sport at the 1996 Games in Atlanta. It definitely stings, said Wilkerson, a 29-year-old from Toronto. Bansley said playing in front of empty stands because of COVID-19 restrictions was a challenge. It was trying to find the balance of bringing our own energy and managing the empty stadium, said the 33-year-old from Waterdown, Ontario. The Americans and Swiss will play in Thursday's semi-finals at the venue overlooking Tokyo Bay, while the Latvians and Australians will go at it for the other spot in the gold medal showdown. Bansley and Pavan were partners earlier in their careers, but a four-year run ended after a loss at the same stage of the 2016 Games in Rio de Janeiro. Pavan and Humana Parades, who was Canada's alternate in Brazil five years ago, are ranked second in the world by the sport's governing body, while Bansley and Wilkerson are tied for 15th.